Minerovic, two wrestlers were right here in Pennsylvania, and Ed Ferraro, this is one outstanding rematch from the state tournament. These two boys met in the AAA states in Hershey just a few weeks ago, <clears throat> and Rob, I'll tell you, you have Thump versus Stay Power. Troy Minerovic can wrestle probably three matches in a row and not be tired. Mike Kahn, very powerful. They had a tremendous battle last time. We'll see what happens in these finals. Just that, amazing how they're back together again after the wars that they went through today and the last few days. That match in the finals of the Class AAA state tournament went all the way to the 30-second tiebreaker with Khan riding out Minerovic in that 30 seconds to preserve a 4-4 win for the state title. Khan is a two-time state champion. Minerovic, the state runner-up this year in his first trip to the state tournament. And Mike Khan in the blue singlet in on the single leg trying to score the first points of this championship round. Mike's got that leg deep, Troy with a whizzer fighting in. See if Khan can finish. Finish for two. And Jim Sterner, our head official in this match, signals two points and the takedown for Mike Khan. Khan from Harrisburg High School. As we said, a two-time class AAA state champion. And Troy Minerovic from Parkland High School out in District 11, where, uh, which is an area that uh, you come from, Ed, and know very well. That's right, Rob. Um, a lot of competition down there. Minerovic and Khan mirror themselves with being rather complete wrestlers. They're both good on their feet, both good on top, and get it out of the bottom, which is why we probably saw that ride out last time. Uh, I'm not anticipating any holding back here. Uh, once again, Michael's just very tough on top, and, and Troy's Gumby on the bottom. So um, we may get a stalemate out of this and start him again. 15 seconds left in the first period and Khan trying the far arm, far leg tilt and uh, Minerovic having none of that. Final seconds ticking down in the first period, two to nothing, still the score in favor of Mike Khan of Harrisburg High in the blue singlet. And we'll go to the second period. Khan a little bit bigger of the two. Jim, the uh, choice goes to Khan and looks like he's going to defer. And Troy Minerovic with the choice. Oh, no, I think apparently, Khan... Apparently Khan decided not to defer to take the choice himself, and he'll start in the down position. You know, sometimes that is not a bad strategy move. You're up 2 nothing. you take the bottom position, you're out. You're up 3 nothing. It kind of changes the complexion of the match. Um, a lot of coaches and even wrestlers tend to miss that at times. There are reasons to and also reasons why not to. Once again, Minerovic is far from a slouch on top. Khan wanting to get out, get that escape, and then if he can pick out a, up a takedown, he'd have a 5 to nothing lead, and he'd really have the match in some control. Now Khan stands up, and Minerovic throws the leg in, brings Khan back down. Khan again trying to stand up and close to a potentially dangerous situation, but Minerovic again brings him back down. Troy, very good with positioning. He um, used that leg lace well, uh, hides his head well, a lot of changes. I'm telling you, these two kids are, are pretty much identical. It's a matter of maybe a mistake here or there that could determine this match. Minerovic. Almost a minute gone here in the second period. Mike Khan of Harrisburg High in Pennsylvania, the two-time Class AAA state champion on the first period takedown, still with a two to nothing lead. Troy Minerovic of Parkland High was working tough on top, but now Mike Kahn hits the switch for the reversal, and that's another two points, and he's doubled his lead to four to nothing. And that's exactly what happened there, Rob. Troy uh, just really wanted to tilt him badly and got way out of position and tried a, a short side tilt with a heavy chop. Khan just sat out with a switch and came around for two. Minerovic very upset about that. That could have been that mistake I was talking about. Well, now Khan uh, looking maybe for a cradle. I think he wants to try looking for that tilt again, maybe post that wrist through the crotch as he uh, did in the first period trying for the tilt. But uh, certainly four to nothing. Khan's in very good shape right now, even though Minerovic's going to have the choice in the third period. Five seconds left to go. Final seconds ticking down in period number two. I'd almost put Minerovic on his feet here. 
I don't know if I'd want him down. And Khan seems to have uh, pretty much control. He's going down. That's, um, well. Minerovic will take the down position for the start of the third period. This is the first third. This is the first of our 14 championship matches in the National High School Wrestling Championships here in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Rob Sherrill with Ed Ferraro and George Von Banco bringing you the action, and Mike Kahn decided he doesn't want any part of uh, Minerovic on the mat. He'll let him go and uh, go for the takedown. Well, I think I've guessed this whole bout basically wrong to this point, Rob. So I'm just going to kind of keep quiet and just call the moves from here on in. Well, it's four to one in favor of Mike Kahn, and uh, Troy Minerovic wants to get some kind of offense established. He uh, was uh, trailing in that state tournament match and came back and tied it up to go into overtime, and I think he really had uh, Kahn air on the ropes, not only late in that match, but also in the overtime. But Kahn has really taken it to him so far. Minerovic definitely uses his stamina and, uh, and his aggressiveness to his favor. Khan smartly is slowing this down with a little quarter Nelson and some hooks, little duck to the opposite side there. Real nice, real nice. Just played some time, got behind both arms. Two point takedown Khan. Monroe's gonna just have to get on his horse and, and just come back with a vengeance here or Mike's gonna walk away with this championship. Under a minute left to go here in the 103 pound match and Mike Khan of Harrisburg High School, the two-time state champion, has narrow has extended his lead to six to one now. Forty seconds left to go, and Khan riding tough on the top. Minerovic trying to stand up, but Khan still staying behind the arms, riding smart, and got the arm barred on the opposite side. And now uh, Minerovic drags out and gets the escape at six to two, three Boy, two. he used that throw by beautifully. Came out front, little front head and arm. Troy was just reaching to try to gain some wrist control and Khan with a real nice throw by. Come behind for two. 10 seconds left to go and Mike Khan, it looks like is gonna be the first national high school champion crowned here in 1997. And that'll do it by a final score of 8-2. to two. The first national high school champion of 1997 at 103 pounds is Mike Kahn. Second place to Troy Minerovic, also of Pennsylvania and Parkland High School. Mike Kahn, real, real determined that match. There's no denying that. So we've crowned one national high school wrestling champion. And in a minute, George Von Benko will be visiting with Mike Kahn as we will visit with all 14 of our championship wrestlers tonight. Next will be the 112 pound match and we'll see another Pennsylvania wrestler there. Chris Kelly of Easton and we'll excuse Ed Ferraro briefly. Ed, one of the, on the coaching staff at Easton High School and he'll spend uh, a match in the corner with, with his protege. And very briefly, we'll have Mike Kahn visiting with George Von Banco in the first of our exit interviews here. 13 matches left to go here in the 8th Annual National High School Wrestling Championships. Now here's George Von Banco with our 103-pound champion, Mike Kahn. Thank you very much, guys. I'm joined by Mike Kahn from Harrisburg, Pennsylvania, Harrisburg High School. Congratulations, Mike. You met this guy before. It was a tough match in the uh, state championship. This time, though, you jumped out early, and it seemed to be a little bit easier for you. Well, I beat him two weeks ago in freestyle, and it wasn't much, didn't much freestyle come into play. It was all on the feet. In the state finals, I just, because I wrestled him, this is about like the fifth or sixth time I wrestled him, and I, in the state finals, I didn't realize that that was the guy I was wrestling, and I wasn't looking for that near on for a leg, and he got me down with that, and I got a few stallings, and we went double overtime. Well, you went after him real quick this time, he got yeah. out with points, and uh, were able to coast after that, so you have to feel good about it. Yeah, yeah, I do. I, I work too many, too much too hard for this. Just feels great. <laughs> How does this rank with winning the state championship, winning a national title like this? It feels good, but truthfully nothing, I don't think, unless I win an NCAA title, I don't think anything can compare to that or an Olympic, so. Mike, 
Thanks again. Congratulations. Mike Kahn, our champion at 103 pounds. Let's go back to you, Rob. Okay.